Hello YouTube. These are my updated spectrum analyzer displays. I made a new PCB for them. And let me just unplug these to show you in detail. These will come now in the smaller 0 0.96 inch display like before or the bigger 1.3 inch display okay and here is the PCB it is all in SMD parts now the special integrated circuit the MSG MSG EQ7 is now the SMD chip the original not those knockoffs from China and this is my OLED Maxi PCB by the way and it has a couple of features like you see now I can have both displays I could even have the bigger display with the 1.5 inch display also with this PCB with the SPI connection anyhow the PCBs come now with the USB micro USB connector it goes out the back I can get it to focus right and it can have a vertical 3.5 millimeter jack or this guy here which will be like this and the plug will come out to the side but I think it will give a cleaner look and might be easier to mount if it goes all the out the back this is the onboard switch for the display modes you can also have a wire connected to it to external switch these will also be available in a stereo version oops upside down I made the PCB so I can just uh, make some solar bridges and have that in stereo I will make an extra video for that too with the new one I just made these two right now and I updated the page on Tindy on my Tindy sh store and you can get them now the small ones you can get in white blue or the yellow blue like you saw the bigger ones you can only get in white or blue this PCB will also be used for my new gear indicator and the voltmeter again it has all the parts on the PCB itself so no more these guys here I used to use these but now not anymore they are all on the PCB itself do I have the PCB to show you I have it somewhere I got so many versions of my PCBs now I do get confused myself where is it where is it where is it yes I have it it's right here so now I have a voltage regulator for the voltmeter and the gear indicator and this is the pinout for the MSG EQ7 chip and it has uh, of course the required parts for it it uh, for the gear indicator I have protection diodes and I can show you the micro USB uh, not my <laughs> the 3.5 jack right now so this will go in I have to look around the phone so it can go outer back to the side or like you see here out the back directly and it also has the micro USB connector for the voltmeter I also have a trimmer that I will put on here before I use the these ones here by the way these parts will go on my CNC controller that I'm just making two of so but uh, all the maxi PCB has all everything on there 
in SMD as you can see here now it's really nice and small of course if, if you don't want the jack here you can just attach wires to it and extend the button also or use uh, one of the many uh, 5 volt and ground connectors to get a wire connection directly to it too the displays are soldered to the PCB that way you can use uh, M2 screws to screw it from the front and attach it to your enclosure if anybody wants to design a 3D enclosure for this let me know and uh, we make a deal I unfortunately don't have enough time to do that also so anyhow these are the new OLED Spectrum devices sold on my Tindy store before I bore you to death that's it for today and I see you soon take care thanks for watching